Minister. It will be brief because we did go through this obviously at committee stage and I think we have a, we have a difference of opinion on it. So just to, to briefly restate uh, my view, to be firstly clear, this bill is a hugely enabling piece of legislation that does provide access to abortion, that does provide for termination of pregnancy here in our own country in a way that, that hasn't been the case up to now. It will allow women to access termination of pregnancy in a safe manner in our own community where possible and free of charge. Uh, the key provisions on the bill are exactly the same as that of the draft general scheme approved by government and published ahead of the referendum and the updated scheme uh, made public in July. So in that sense, there's no surprises uh, in terms of what the title of this bill is doing or indeed what this bill is endeavouring uh, to do. I, I would just make a couple of brief points. The reference to ending the life of the fetus, we did have this debate uh, at committee stage as well where the committee would have received a letter uh, from the doctors drawing up the clinical guidelines to say that regardless of the debate we have in here that that's actually a phrase that clinically they find useful because that is how they define the issue clinically uh, as well and look this is a bill about access to abortion of that there is no doubt and people can call the reasons all they want in terms of pejorative terms but the legal advice available to me is that it is better uh, to align the wording in the bill with the wording of the constitution and after an area that has been subject to so much court adjudication and challenge uh, over so many decades i for one don't intend to take any risk to do anything that would uh, heighten the success of any challenge or otherwise so these are technical uh, legal titles and um, they do reflect accurately what this bill uh, is endeavouring to do. I do appreciate people's intention in trying to change that wording, uh, but to do so would not be in line with the legal requirements and advice, and therefore I don't propose to accept these amendments.